Hi guys. Hi guys. We're gonna do stuff a little bit different. We're at my house, mine and Kara's house, and it's Palm Sunday. So we're gonna talk to you um, about a little story and we're gonna start off with our little puppet show that we like to do every Sunday. So, there's Daffodil. Hi teacher. Hi Daffodil. Tell me, why were you carrying that music CD? Because it has my special favorite songs on it, and I love to sing them. I didn't know that. Oh, yes. I love to sing. I sing when I'm swimming. I sing when I'm ready to take a nap on the soft grass. I love to sing. Do you sing when you're underwater? <laughs> yes, it's funny. What are your favorite songs about? Well, right now I like to sing songs about the springtime and the new baby ducks, and the tadpoles in the pond, and the blossoms in the woods. That reminds me of a time in the Bible when people sang a special song to Jesus. They sang a special song to show they welcomed Jesus. Really? Can I hear your song to welcome Jesus? What do you think, kids? Can we sing a song to tell Jesus we're glad for him and that we love him? Please, I want to hear it. Okay, kids, let's sing. good singers and that is a good song well daffodil the bible says that it's good to sing praises to the lord i like it especially the la 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 part daffodil you can sing well too you know teacher i really like to sing it shows how glad i am we have another way to show we're glad for jesus too you mean there's more ways to show you're glad Yes, we can tell him. We can pray to tell Jesus how we feel and say we love him. Oh, that's a very good way to show you're glad. So now I'm going to um, tell you a little story in the Bible. And don't forget that we still want to be working on our uh, memory verses. And I hope that you guys had a chance to go and get your work pages like we normally do on Sundays. And let's put the stickers in pack. But here's the memory verse. Sing the praises of the Lord. Psalms 9-11. So here's the little story we have for you today. It was a special time of year. Many people were walking to the temple in the big city of Jerusalem. Jesus and his friends were going too. On the way, Jesus said to two of his friends, Go to the next town. You will find a donkey there. Untie it and bring it to me. If anyone asks where you're taking the donkey, tell them I need it. 
they will let you have the donkey. Jesus' friends went and untied the donkey. They led it to Jesus. Jesus' friends spread a coat over the donkey's back for Jesus to sit on. He sat down on the donkey. Off went the donkey, clippity-clop. Jesus' friends walked along beside him. The road was full of people walking to Jerusalem. There were boys and girls, moms and dads, grandmas and grandpas. Some of them watched as Jesus went by. Others walked along beside him. As people heard the news that Jesus was coming, more people came. So many people wanted to see Jesus that it was almost like a parade. Children sang happy songs as they skipped along the road. Some people spread their coats on the road to show how important they thought Jesus was. Other people cut branches from the palm trees and laid the branches on the road. The road looked like a colorful carpet. People welcomed Jesus as a king. Some people ran on ahead. They told others, Jesus is coming, Jesus is coming. And even more people came. They laughed and sang, Hosanna, Hosanna. They shouted, God bless the one who comes in the name of the Lord. Did you know Hosanna is a special word the people said to welcome Jesus? Soon the people inside the city heard the singing and shouting. They ran out to Jesus too. Jesus is coming. Jesus is coming. They shouted. People sang and waved branches in the air as Jesus rode the donkey through the big gate to the city. He rode up the hill to the temple where he got off the donkey and walked up the steps of the temple. And there he heard the happy sound of children singing. They were singing, Hosanna, Hosanna. It was a wonderful day in the big city of Jerusalem. People everywhere were praising Jesus. They sang and shouted, and Jesus was especially glad to hear the children praise him. The, the people in Jerusalem were glad to praise Jesus. We can praise Jesus too. We can tell him we love him and we can sing songs to thank him for his love. The Bible says, sing praises to the Lord. So I hope you guys all have a good week and Kara and I will be here next week to talk with you with another story. Be good to your moms and dads and um, stay safe. We love you.